a sweet scene. Now, see, this, this whole experience is marred, because I'm going to talk to the, the Catherine Heigl fans for a second, if I may. Recently, Catherine got married. She's off the market. <laughs> <laughs> Just so we can all fit a name to this figure of hate, who's this man you've married? <laughs> figure of hate. I'm going to say that when I'm mad at him. Uh, Mr. Josh Kelly, he's a musician, singer, songwriter. I'm so happy for him. <laughs> no, seriously, congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> there is always some, I find, always some sort of disaster at a wedding. What, what went wrong at yours? Anything? Or was it super smooth? We had a couple, but they were all sort of pre-wedding and then one after wedding. Josh got injured in a ski accident before oh, the wedding. Oh, such a shame. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> poor, poor Josh. How bad was it? He just you know, split his nose open. Oh, his heart. goodness. That's yeah. pretty bad, actually. Really nice it? for the wedding pictures. And then he lost his wedding band uh, not even 24 hours after the ceremony, so that was fun. Did he find it? He found it. My goodness. Yeah. He's quite Shocking. a guy. Yeah. <laughs> he would never have lived that down if he hadn't found it. <laughs> you, you know, in, in Britain, the falling always takes place at a wedding. For instance, one girl desperately tries to catch the wedding bouquet. Is it the same stateside? You know what? I forgot to throw my wedding bouquet. I know. I'm actually... I, I remember the next morning and I went back to the house and there was my bouquet sitting on the counter and I went, oh, my God, I never tossed the bouquet. Like, there are little things that you Someone's just Someone's not going to get married do. because of you. I know. I ruined someone's chances. You've got to call your friends together know, and do it again. Maybe just toss it now. Yeah, you have to. That's you okay. have to. A little late. Um, there's always a couple gratuitously snogging in the corner or in the loo, <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Does that happen stateside? <laughs> No. If it did, no one fessed up to it, and I didn't notice. So. I guarantee it did. <laughs> um, some of the aunties drink too much sherry and act inappropriately. You know, like in Friends, they want to kiss you on the lips. Why do they do that? <laughs> I don't want to kiss my auntie on the lips. It's weird. Does know. it happen stateside? I don't think so. Not, not to me, at least. Not this time. Yeah, you're very lucky. I get it all the time. It's <laughs> on the lips. Aunties. I'm going to say that. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's talk Grey's Anatomy. Okay. Fantastic show. Huge in the States. Huge here. Um, series 4 is about to start. I know there's thousands of fans watching. Um, please tell us your character, Izzy and George. Stop all the silliness. We get it together. <laughs> Do they? No, of course not. That doesn't make good drama, does it? I mean, I just, we're four series into the show. I deserve that. No one can be happy. <sighs> Happiness and good relationships don't make good drama. No one would watch if everybody was in a healthy and good relationship. So definitely no. Probably not. Now, I don't even know, actually, because I thought, you know, maybe uh, Izzy and Alex were going to get back together. Mm. Maybe so... if Izzy, Alex and George get now, together. Now, that could be happiness. You guys have a TV show. <laughs> um, wonderful. And drama. <laughs> All at once. <laughs> uh, Catherine, let's talk about movies. You're, you know, a successful movie star. What's it like? <laughs> I don't know. Someone tell me. <laughs> what should I do? I don't know. It's kind of uh, surreal. I, I, I think the best, best part is that people are actually watching my work. I've yeah. worked a long time and nobody watched it. So it's now they great are. to have people in seats. It's in really the, nice. Yeah. Um, you are a supremely gifted actress in films and TV shows. Um, we hear that you have many other talents, though. I do. If I may. Yeah. See if you can confirm <laughs> these or not. We hear that you're a very capable knitter. Yes, that I can do. Could you um, show well, me your move? I should have brought oh, just, you my just, knitting. Just my me. Act, act in, it. wrap, out, off. In, wrap, out, off. <laughs> wow. <laughs> um, wow. Um, this, this is my favourite, though, Catherine. Uh, we hear you have a talent. I'm extremely, extremely envious. You have the ability to milk a cow. I have milked a cow once. Yes? Yeah, yeah, that was I'm, fun. I'm going to put this to the yeah. test right now. If you bring a cow out oh, here... Oh, no, <laughs> better than that. I'm going to act like a cow. <laughs> this is Milk so me. creepy <laughs> and awkward. If you could just pull one of those... <laughs> not milking. Milk me, damn you! Milk me! <laughs> so just just tug one. Yeah! <laughs> Catherine Heigl milked me. It's official. Catherine, you are like fantastic. It's a bad episode of uh, Meet the Parents. Oh, my God. <laughs> now my, all my buttons are popping. Catherine, this is awkward. Please keep really your clothes awkward. on, Catherine. I'm it's trying. not that type of show. <laughs> You're such a sport. Thanks very much. Catherine Heigl, everyone. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs>